This is Professor Elwe Gaikwad's English Literature Wave. I am Professor Elwe Gaikwad. He is teaching today on the topic Lecture 357 and the topic is Reduplication in Morphology. Here going to the topic we will see at first two suggestions. The first is my request to like and subscribe my YouTube channel. The second request I will do is that we see all the notes which I have put in the description box. Now we will go to the topic. Morphology is a science in which morphemes are studied. Remember morphology is the particular branch in which the morphemes are studied. Reduplication occurs in morphology. So reduplication is the part of the morphology. They are compounding words, means the words which come in the reduplication are called the compounding words. They have two or more elements, that is the parts. They are identical or only slightly different, means they are identical, means we can easily understand them or only slightly different, means they are uh, different from each other with a little bit difference. For example, a sight seeing, good, goody, din, din, tick, tock, tip, tock, etc. Reduplications are different, means reduplicatives are different in initial consonants, means the consonants which come at the beginning are different, such as walkie talkie. When we discuss the example walkie talkie, then we see that all the uh, consonants here means W and T are different from each other and they have come initially these words. They are different in the medieval vowels, medial vowels sorry, medial vowels such as crisscross. When we think of the crisscross uh, reduplicatives then we find that there is the difference of the vowel means in the first cris there is E vowel and in the second cross there is O vowel. The reduplicatives have the meaning separately means they give us the separate meanings. For example, C saw means there is C and saw. These are the two words which have the different meanings. Has the meanings of alternating moments means these two words have the alternating moments means C and saw has the uh, alternative moment that is this or that means when the child goes into the garden the child sits on the seesaw and they both two childs are there and they play that game and in that game one child goes up and the second child comes down that is the situation and that's why it is called the alternating moment and also its name is see saw. The reduplicatives like higlady piglady, wishy washy show the instable nature or nonsense. Means when we want to say something to the person who is nonsense, then we can call that person with these uh, reduplicatives. In the reduplicatives, the root or stain as a morphine or the whole word is repeated exactly or with a minor change. Here the explanation is that in the reduplicatives the root or stem means root or stem means the basic morpheme. As a morpheme means it is the morpheme or it is the whole word is repeated exactly exactly it is repeated or with a minor change means it changes with a minor change also. The reduplicatives are more in languages. They show the function of plurality and intensification and create new words. Remember, all these reduplicatives create the new words and we know the innovative words to study. They link morphology and phonology repeating words, means they repeat words and we know the study of uh, morphology and phonology. 
they help infants in learning means when there are the children they learn with the help of these reduplicatives now we will see the next topic the next topic is types of reduplicatives the first is rhyming reduplicatives it means they give us rhyme they give us music and so they are called the rhyming reduplicatives for example hanky panky razzle dazzle super duper boogie oogie walkie talkie easy peasy humpty dumpty it is see are the rhyming reduplicatives and they create rhyme here or they create intonation here or they create the music here now the next topic is exact reduplicatives it means that here they um, pronounce they pronounce exactly means the exact means there is the repetition of the same uh, sounds i will say uh, for example boo boo bye bye choo choo 50 50 pom pom wa wa it is see show the words uh, and they show the strength and exact repetition now the third topic is abloud reduplication uh, it means that they uh, are in the alter alternation situation i will say or they uh, they change the alternation in vowels means we find the uh, alternation in vowels so for example we will see uh, flip flop see a uh, flip means there is the e vowel and flop there is the o vowel hip hop again the same situation ding dong again is the same situation tip top again there is the same situation ping pong again there is the same situation sing song again there is the same position zig zag again there is the same position now we will discuss the fourth topic the fourth topic is comparative reduplication or comparative reduplicatives so here for example we will see ugier and ugier or swagger and swagger so remember here swagger and swagger shows the confidently walking or behaving now the fifth uh, i will say topic is or the type is uh, i will say contra contrastive reduplicatives now here we will give the examples milk milk we see milk milk means there is the contrast then silk silk tick 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 din din lin lin means these all uh, i will say words or reduplicatives uh, showing are showing here the contrast means they are coming exactly means they are coming same or they are coming equal with each other and they are showing the different situation or the uh, contrast i will say so the last point is conclusion when we see the conclusion then Now we see the significance of the reduplication so uh, reduplication is the significant subject of descriptive and theoretical research it is the i will say inter branch of morphology grammar phonology syntax and semantics this is useful for children's learning to speak meaningful polysyllabic words without complex structures so here today we have finished the topic again we will be in front of each other with a new topic till then thank you thank you very much